We continue this segment with Darren Mattox speaking about the survival game without football as his main income. It is said that two of the hardest things to do is to tell someone I love you and to talk about Christ. But Darren Mattox says it's pride that is stopping some persons. The toughest thing to do is to really tell someone about Jesus, right? Because it, it it, it has become so taboo to people to hear somebody talk about Christ, right? And perfect example, when I just started going on Instagram, there was people saying, oh, I am, I am crazy. Like literally them think mentally something was wrong with me, right? Because the transition happened so quick. They'd be like, no, like something really, something, he might go through something. Something really mentally wrong, right? He's unstable mentally, right? But who is me for people to think that about when even Jesus himself went to the house of Israel and he said Abraham was glad to see my day and they thought it was crazy because he said you are not even 50 oh could you see Abraham and he said before Abraham I was or I am the same I am he said to Moses go tell him I am who I am so they thought Jesus was crazy right so who is me to people say oh he's crazy and then as I said to tell somebody that you love them it's because genuinely it is pride why you can't tell somebody say you, you love them. It is pride. It's the same thing. If you can't tell somebody about Jesus, you might not know it is pride, but it is pride. You walk away from what has been putting food on your table. That's football. Mm -hmm. Well paid, as you mentioned. And you still have a whole lot of life ahead of you. And this is where you're earning came from. Mm -hmm. Now people be asking, <laughs> do you have enough in the tank? Which means, do you have enough in the bank, <laughs> the to, bank to, to, to carry you <laughs> forward now that you, 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 you have given up football and that earning? Um, you know, funny enough, um, people might think the primary source was football, which looking at it, it was and it is, but the ultimate provider was 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 the Lord, you know, he was the one who was providing all along. So he, he just used football as a source to provide for me, right? So I am not worried so much about what is in the tank or the bank, right? What I'm worrying about who is leading me, right? And his grace is sufficient, right? So it doesn't matter because the Lord can put things in place by tomorrow, make it $10 million, right? But I was, the Lord has always provided for me playing football, are not playing and I have not been earning for a, lo a while now right but as I say I was a well paid footballer right so I there, 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 there was time in my life where I wish I saved better but there's also time in my life that I made smart investments right there's smart investment so to this day I am still living comfortably you know what I mean it might it might not be as I was playing football but the Lord is still providing right so a lot of people might think okay oh we might well i won't say people but a couple of people might wonder right but as i say to this day me still me still dress nice me can travel more me can go wherever do whatever more cause why the grace from the lord is sufficient the lord is the ultimate provider so when time me when time me focus upon christ he has never failed me yet you know what i'm saying you never see the, the righteous forsaken and the seed begin bread and that and i'm a perfect example have you given up totally and playing football? Not playing football at a recreational level, but playing football at a competitive competitive level where you have been paid. So going back to, to work as a footballer, uh, have you given up on that job? Honestly, yes. That and 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 that is the honest truth from me, right? Because. Not because of what I wanted, but because of how oh, I see the Lord using me, right? Oh, I'm being led. You know, the Bible says the sons of God, are those who are being led by the Spirit of God are, are the sons of God, right? So if I'm being led in this way, maybe two months later, God said, okay, all right, um, I am going to give you two more years in a football, right? He will tell me. He will t I promise you, he will tell me, right? And if him say he's going to open a door, he's going to open an avenue, right if a team comes and say darren why think about this compound trials are because you don't play football for over your compound trials make us see how you stay right if somebody i don't turn them down right away i wait until god speak to me right 
I wait until God speaks to me. So if God gives me the go ahead to play football, I will go back. But for right now, how the Lord is using me is where I am at. I actually walk away while I was in my prime. So to say, I say this to say that I could still contribute at a higher level if I decided to get back in shape and play, right? Because genetically, that was just something that was God-given to me, right? But as I said, to walk away and, 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 and not so much, um, I don't worry about money, let's say that. So I am in good hands. <laughs> and it's not just ministry that Matt Ox is currently doing. He has also written a book. I gave my class an assignment to do, right? And, and each of them... When they gave me but the written assignment, there was one night I was in my living room and there was one of my class and we we were on um faith time together we had talk. I mess with Georgia, you know say me can turn this in one book. Because when I put all the assignments together, I realized say it could be in a book, but that was the spirit of God leading me, right? So it was a couple of days ago I actually finished this book, right? So now I am looking to 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 get a publisher and then eventually um release it on Amazon so you guys can look out for a book from 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 me and my and my Bible class because it was the 14 of us actually put it was their foundation of what I told them to do and we actually put it together. What's the name of the book? It is called um The Gospel of the Saints. The Gospel of the Saints something simple but you know it is it, it is if if i can show you something real quick i'm not sure if you guys can catch this um on the camera right so it's called the gospel of the saints this is really how many pages that is it is about 140 pages so you know hopefully to take it on take it you guys can purchase it on amazon eventually Still to come, coach Hamer Hawkinson says the poor pitches in Jamaica are hurting players.